Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to my garage. So a couple days ago, I put out a video uh, about about a, a customer of mine that called me and asked me to come do a roof inspection, and they were going to have solar put on, and the solar company said it was going to be a crazy amount of money, 25000 or something like that. Uh, and she just decided not to do it, and, and she's not going to worry about her roof. Uh, but I, I made that video thinking that people out there are actually spending twenty five, thirty, thirty five thousand dollars to put solar panels on the roof. It's crazy. Um, for five thousand bucks, you can build a hell of a system. Um, Ten thousand bucks builds a monster system. You can take a lot of stuff off grid with all that. I, I kind of took the time to lay things out here and and give you an idea uh, of what we're what you could spend and what you could end up with if you uh just spent five thousand or seventy five hundred or ten grand all right so as it stands i got the whiteboard here and you can see um i have a 5k a 7500 and a ten thousand uh system laid out ten thousand dollar system laid out the top there in the purple is the totals that it costs uh, as far as batteries go here um this battery is a 24 volt 200 amp hour uh I think it was a Ridodo is the one I actually used to get my price. Uh, so the two there says two of those uh, equals thirty-two fifty. Uh, the inverters uh, I, I chose all Guillendel inverters. I, I like my Guillendel, uh, and, and that's what I use for my pricing and all this. Charge controllers I used EP Evers because they're affordable and, and they work. Uh, trying to keep the price down and, and get you the most bang for your buck, and then panels. Uh, our 24 volt, 200 watt. Uh, I I, th I want to say Rich Solar is the panels that I was quoting off of, but they're all really close. 250 bucks uh, a panel will get you a 24 volt, 200 water. Now on the bottom there, as you can see, M uh, wire, MC4 connectors, uh, fuses in the rack. Uh, for the 500, or for the 5,000, the 7,500 K system. Um, you know, 500, 600 bucks should do it. Uh, when you get up to the 10K system, you're going to need a little bit bigger wire and everything else. Uh, so it, it, I added a couple hundred more dollars. Uh, as far as the 10K system goes, uh, I, I used 48 volt, 100 amp hour server rack batteries uh, and chose four of those. Uh, so that gets you a 6950, a uh, 48 volt, 5600 watt hybrid system from, I, I want to say, Grow Watt Solar. Uh, I, that's a tough choice on which system to pick, but that's the one I picked. Uh, and then the battery or the the panels uh, would be six twenty four volt wired for forty eight volt. Um, so you'd have three uh, three panels, three sets all together anyway. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, if you spent five k, um, you're going to have a hell of a system. Uh, at seventy five hundred bucks, you are going to have a huge system. I mean, you're talking about uh, what six hundred amp hours. Uh, 600 amp hour 24 volt battery is a ton of uh, a ton of stored power a lot a lot uh, and your inverter with 4,000 watts you know you could probably run your refrigerator your television um, your salt pump your security system all the stuff that I run here uh, and on top of that a few other things like lights around the house and whatnot um, I just think it's crazy to spend 20 grand and then sign a contract and let somebody else reap the rewards you don't need all those panels up on your roof. Um, even with the 48 volt system, this one here, you would only have six panels up there. Uh, it's still putting out a ton of power, but you only need six panels. It's crazy uh, what what those solar companies are doing to people. They're totally ripping you off. Well, I hope that somebody can gain some knowledge from some of this stuff. Uh, I priced it all out this morning, um, just trying to make it so people can understand that, yeah, 10 grand, Man, a 48 volt, 400 amp hour server rack battery, that's a, that's a lot of power. That's a lot of stored power. Uh, and a 5600 watt hybrid inverter will run a lot of stuff. Uh, you, you, depending on how many people are in your household or how big your household is, I, I would almost bet that that 10K system uh, would probably run a house for two, for a small house for two people if they were um, trying real hard to conserve energy. Uh, you might even be able to go off grid, totally off grid with that uh, for nine months out of the year. Uh, you, you'd have to keep the, the the grid power so you can, in the winter time when it gets cruddy, you're, you're going to need it. 
Uh, either that or you're going to have to have a generator and run it on gas, but obviously I think I would keep the grid power as a, as a backup. But nonetheless, uh, you know, people don't get trapped out there and spend twenty, thirty, forty, fifty thousand dollars $50,000. It's crazy. Don't do it. Uh, you know, don't do it. That's all I could say. Hey, everybody, have a good day and a better tomorrow.